guys. <laughs> See, <laughs> I wish y'all knew. I wish y'all knew the struggles. Anyway, welcome to Escape Vlogs, uh, episode three. I hope you've watched one and two, where we were showcasing the star, the star Ooh, wow. into. So today, oh, being modest. today, 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 we're gonna be doing the. 36 questions of love which Sarah has researched on <laughs> yes I, I made it clear Please wow know that she's practiced eh? and i've not because i'm not going to case of it tata sangu <laughs> so the 36 questions um, apparently they're supposed to lead to love if you google them you'll find them they're fantastic questions they just get you to like an insight of someone's soul and who someone is mm -hmm. truly yeah. in their heart mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. How this is going to work we have numbers written down in this let's yeah, yeah. Ooh, okay tell us from a practice uh, a session a session that the camera yeah. decided it wants to <laughs> sleep not now yeah anyway so uh, uh what was I saying? <laughs> uh, we'll pick a number uh -huh. uh, ideally how it's normally done we answer like the questions we both answer the questions but today just because we're a bit different you answer the question that you pick so the number the questions are numbered from 1 to 36 so the, so the number, number that you pick is the question, is the question that you answer. yeah what she said yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah so, so let's start start us off honey i'm gonna start with number 23 hiya red tossy number 23 23. Oh wow. Okay. How close and warm is your family? And do you feel your childhood was happier than most other people's? My family is very, 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 we're very close because we're we're not so many. We're just four. My sister, my mom, and dad, mm. and plus myself. So we're just four, <laughs> and we're we're very, very close. Uh, we talk about basically everything. everything. And yeah. then uh, the other question was what? Oh, do I feel like my yeah. childhood was? Good. It was beautiful. Kwanza mine specifically, it was very very good. I grew up with my mom there the whole time. I'm yeah. like a uh, what is it called? Mama's child. Mama. Yeah, with very soft hands by the way because I did nothing. So, but she cooks <laughs> now very good food. Yeah, Ooh. yeah, yeah. Because she was, she was working with me all the way, every step of the way. Adi kwa jikoni. So we learned. Yeah. So I feel like my childhood was good. I played all those games. Kina kati ni 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 and. I have been brought up knowing what life is. Si yeah. you like to ni kukana kukwaja, yeah. 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 Yes, so yeah, it was good. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, that's really nice. I think uh, growing up, I've, re I've realized some of those things you can't take for granted. Yeah, you can't. Like, like people very, have memories, dysfunctional like, families, families and all yeah. that. Mm -hmm. So even I come from a very warm family mm -hmm. and I'm very thankful. Very, very thankful for that. Pick your number. Number 12. Number 12. Number 12. 12 off. As people say, if you could wake up tomorrow having gained any one quality or ability, what would it be? I think I would learn how to play an instrument without the work. I knew but it had to do with it. music. Okay. <laughs> Listen, guys, it's just because. Yeah. It takes such a long time, which is only fair. Oh, like yeah. life is just set up yeah. like that. You just don't get things instantly. But I wish I could just wake up and have maybe, I think I, I would choose maybe keys mm -hmm. or voice, because mm -hmm. uh, the others I enjoy the learning process, like guitar and drums. Mm -hmm. But I would just wake up and have like vocal technique like Beyonce without Ash. having to put in Ash. all the work right. that needs to go into to it. Go into it. <laughs> all right, fine. Uh, next question. Question. Yeah. Number 16. Hey, from that 4A. Rasma one. Rasma one. I tell you, I'm going to number 16. To don, yes. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. let, these questions are fantastic. All you right. guys should really do them. Uh, what do you value most in a friendship? Okay. What I value most in a friendship is, I think, genuineness and honesty yeah that is what i value most in friendship and she's very genuine and honest yeah. even the, the day she died be like shooting i was like not today i'm like you, you're being great because I, I just don't want you coming to act yeah and looking yeah. like you're performing yeah. so come <laughs> 
Anyway, yeah, yeah. Genuineness and honesty. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, I totally yeah. agree. Yeah. That's fantastic. Next. I love this question. Okay, I just feel like my heart is feeling mushy mushy now. Yeah, it's very nice. Oh. 26. 26. Let's see. Complete this sentence. I wish I had someone with whom I could share dash 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 dash. <laughs> Um, I wish I had someone with whom I could share. <laughs> no, actually, I know the right answer for that All question. Right, right, right. I wish I had someone who I could share with mm. the love of lemonades and mojitos. Guys, I feel like okay, we can look into the lens. Go yeah, by the way, yeah, you guys. Love sugary stuff. If I just had someone who understood how good lemonades and mojitos, mojitos are. are because everyone is just like, why are you drinking that? It's just like, oh. Yeah, she, it's, you know what it's like, like sugar. Me, I'm up for milkshakes, do you what? Like, what are those? It's so good, it's so good. Because I should have like lemonade for at cafe. Mm. Oh my god. It's so good. Uh, All right, let's carry on with your lemonade. I don't have any in this house, but <laughs> we will look for them. Oh my god. <laughs> I next. Hey. So, I've got hope I'm sure. Number 19. Oh, number 19. Number 19. If you knew that in one year you would die suddenly, would you change anything about the way you are living now and why? The way I'm living now? Yeah. What do you mean the way I'm living now? No, it says, okay, let me repeat the question. Yeah. If you knew that in one year you would die suddenly, so mm. you had one year to Yeah, to plan. Yeah. Mm. Would you change anything about the way you are now living? Yeah, you are and now wow. living. And why? <laughs> wow. And, and <laughs> why? Wow. why? Uh, if I was, uh, if I knew I'm gonna die in one year, yeah, probably at 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 least even leave a small impact that I've made. Maybe even though it's not actually like it's really amassing wealth, getting yeah. rich, having yeah. educated, maybe the less fortunate in yeah. such or anything. I don't know. Just at least even touch the life or help someone or even make spoken life one, like more meaningful. yeah, more meaningful. Like I'd live. Not that I'm not living the purpose, yeah. but I would I would do it more. It would be intensified. Yeah, it would be intensified. Like if it's, uh, I don't know. Yeah. I just I just live a more meaningful life. Yeah. yeah. I have a full up question. And even serve serve God like with, with all the energy yeah. I have left, right? Yeah. I have a question, a full up question. It's not here now, mm-hmm. but I think that's something I should also ask myself. Mm. Why are you not doing that now? I am doing it. I am doing it, but I just do it more, more yeah. to have like more impact. Yeah, Which I feel like I should start doing. Yeah, yeah, if you think about it, like it's 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 different when you know your time, your days, and like you're yeah unlimited. But if you, in retrospect, like if you think about it again, mm. I'm not even sure if I get home today. She would wait. Where? But uh-huh. like we are not yeah it's, sure of the next yeah. minute and the next minute. Yeah, sure. So I don't know. Mm. I think. Me, my prayer is just Let's every right. day to have the courage to do, to live a meaningful life without being afraid of True, yes. and all that. Who's speaking? Yeah. Me. Yeah, yeah oh, oh. 20. You need I knew. What does friendship mean to you? In fact, I, oh. I was just <laughs> reading that question. Like, you know, the phone, I was like, hmm. the next question. So, what does friendship mean to you? It means the Tell world me. to me mm-hmm. because I'm an extrovert. Mm-hmm. And I, I I can't keep things to myself. Yeah, which is really really good because yeah. these things don't end up like eating you from the inside. Yeah. So like when you speak your mind and share with people, you get to like uh, relieve a part of yeah. it. Plus yeah. you feel like you're sharing a part of your soul with some, and I feel like that's a huge part of yeah. me. Just you know, having a world with which is like a one big jumbo hug yeah. or something. So yeah. friendship means. Everything. Everything. Airplane. 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 Okay. Number 22. We should shuffle these cards. <laughs> Number 22. Mm. Why are you thinking? It's long. Like, it's long. All right. Yeah, just keep them along. It's like, uh, it includes five. Uh, number points. 25. Okay, you should seriously shuffle this thing. Number 25. Number 25. Yeah. Make three true. We statements for each one since we are both in this room feeling. Okay, so it says make a this That's too long. Okay, again, number 30. 
Ooh. When did you last cry in front of another person and by uh, or by yourself? By so it says, when did you last cry in front of another person? Question mark and then by yourself? Question mark. Also, there are two questions. Oh, when did you last cry in, in front, front of, of another, another person? person? Oh, do I remember? In front of another person. Do I remember? Oh yes, I remember when I was being injected. <laughs> Alex, you're watching this. Really? <laughs> when I was being injected, well, Alex is my little brother. But when I was being injected, I, I cried. I really, really cried because I'm afraid of Shindanos. Like, it was a dream. So it was not so. Yeah, it was. <laughs> so like like, the hey, yeah, I'm like, ah, yeah. my nurse is like, Madam, now that will just I was like, hey, yeah. Hey. When you say you're going to, my time is coming and it's by four. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. <laughs> yes. And, and then by myself, I think is most of the time when I pray, especially at night, because uh, I'm praying for like great, 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 uh, great, great things and greater things. things, yeah, great and mighty things, yeah, to 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 me. Like mm. so, they come in the form of God's blessings. Yeah, that's what I'm praying for. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Aya. To a number four. Number four. Number four is straightforward. Number four says, What would you constitute a perfect day for you? What is an ideal? No, not ideal, but what is a perfect day? How would you describe a perfect day? perfect day for me. It's when you played all your instruments and sang and hey, no 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 it doesn't have anything to do. Are you sure? Music. Okay music is a part of yeah. it of uh -huh. course. But but I think um like how I'm feeling now I'm feeling like I'm sharing my heart and my soul. Mm -hmm. I, I don't know if you get what I'm saying yeah. but I just feel I don't know it's how I feel now I, I I don't know if it's about the questions or if it's you or anything, but I feel like how I feel when I know the spirit of God is close to me. It's like a certain peaceness, oh, yeah. peace and, and calm, yeah. a certain peace of mind. So a perfect day would be a day when I feel like this from start to end. Oh yeah, without having you know yeah, well, yeah. even when you play the morning like, so you know what I always yeah. tell you like, <laughs> like, a day that doesn't have yeah a day that you don't have to struggle through it like for yeah. you to end you're like when when is just when is this day going to be yeah. a day will or just like, what have, more could happen you know yeah, yeah so just like those days are not and, and for me I think it's even just mm -hmm. even when in the midst of the craziness of the world the day that from beginning to end, I'll just have immense peace and joy. From yeah, start from to start to end. Because this day you get it, and then something happens, it takes it away from you from like for like three hours, mm. and then you go back. But just a day from beginning to end. To the end, yeah. yeah. All right, the next one, and then I think. Oh, this is the last one. These are the last the ones. And yeah. So I'm picking number. Choose wisely. Thirty-four. Thirty-four. Me, I know the answer to this question. Right. Not for you, for me. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Your house containing everything you own catches fire. Hey, God she do it. After saving <laughs> your loved ones and your pets, you don't have a pet though. Okay. You have <laughs> you have time to safely make a final dash to save any one item. What would it be and why? What should it be and why? Hey, this camera that we're using to vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, yeah. I've, I've told my cousin that before because I remember telling her, "Ata wa izio kikuja, pini na kanga ika meram tu ezi pata." Not that because that is G, it's G where or where. Yeah. But I think we've just gone through a lot with this camera from my project. <laughs> even just all today. Of it, it's it's state of the art, by the way. Even but today. Yeah, even just today, <laughs> street telling this G memory card has done what? I'm like, it's just a new one. We just got yeah. It. But I'm like. <sighs> But I'd, I'd still save you. Save Camera, it. I'll save you. Yes. Hallelujah. We praise God. We'll still Not even the phone. The phone is on, yeah. on the verge of dying. So if I tell you what I'd save, what you'd you feel do? bad for saying what you've saved. You'd feel like you're very responsible. Uh, so what would you save? Okay, like in this house, what would you save? Okay, not in this house. Okay, yeah. Like, in like your house. Yeah, what would you save? I'd go, there's this folder. 
that has all my certificates. Oh, fine. Now I don't have documents yet. Okay. Okay. <laughs> That's why. Right. Okay. You're, you're, okay. You actually thought fine. Yeah. But yeah. me, I'd say I don't have docu- that, 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 that folder that with with. It has all my certificates. Of course. So, like, but you this can music can give No, they are online. But you know when you go places and they're like, yeah, they're like original, the original certificates. Yeah. Hey, yeah. and then the way replacing documents in this country is hell. It's so hell, 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 hard. Number sita. Number sita. Hey, this is the last one. I am. You better yeah. have a tough one. Let me see. Oh, oh wow! If you're able to live to the age of ninety and retain either the mind or body of a 30 year old for the last 60 years of your life which would you want i don't feel like i've read it well so if you're able to live to the age of 90 and retain either the mind or the body of a 30 year old for the last 60 years of your life which one would you want i definitely retain the body you live to the age of 90, would you retain your mind or retain the body of a 30 year old? Yeah, that's the point. Like, what do I keep from my yeah, 30s? What, yeah, you are 90, but do you, would you wish to have the, the, still mind. the young mind that can reason and everything, or just to have the body of a 30 year old? No, but say you're 90. where I'm saying the body is this is how I'm reasoning. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I might be wrong, but this is how I'm saying it. Mm-hmm. Like, when you're old, you're very wise. Mm-hmm. And when you're 30, mm-hmm. is when like you're figuring out your life, life kind of yeah. so i don't want to be in that mental space when i'm 90. hey me i want to be there all that wisdom of ghana See, over there, you're 90. Then... now when you're 90 you have all that wisdom yeah, yeah. imagine what would you retain so would you choose like my body mind? but yeah. i have the mind of a 90 year old which is like has all the wisdom and knowledge gathered yeah the, the point is would you retain the mind or the body the body because listen to what i'm saying yeah. i have the body of a 30 year old uh-huh. so i'm banging i'm yeah. like oh yes, yes. But I have the wisdom of a 90 year old. Can you imagine your Shosho giving you wisdom? Yeah, looking they, like a 30 year old. You're not getting the point of this this question. As in, you're living to the age of 90. Yes. Would you want a 90 year old person? Would you rather have that mind and still look old? Because they're wise. Or would you have a, rather have the mind and look old? Or would you go for the body? Like the 30 year old body? Like, mtu, okay. Okay, like you become like a Zuzu. But then then you are 90. Lose. Not, not like that way, like lose your memory. Oh, yeah. I don't lose my memory. Yeah, that's what I was trying to But say. if I'm keeping the mind of a 90 year old, yeah. and then I have the body, body of a 30 year old, yeah, then that I'd, would be fine. I'd have the body of a 30 year old, but all the wisdom of a 90 year old. So, this is someone who doesn't want to age. Clearly, she'll be doing escape vlogs for the longest time. So, they can time. be able to like, perform <laughs> when I'm 90 years old. All right, guys. So, thank you so much for watching. This yes. is six questions, but we did the 36 because it would have just been so, so long. long but those are just some of the insights we had within ourselves yeah. that we've shared with you so padding shot subscribe like share and and go. please go go do this with your friends like it helps with looking into yourself mm-hmm. and being vulnerable with your friend which is very important like yeah. she said like genuinely and honestly Clean.